here to present over his decorated career, this Cal Bear collected 25 international gold medals, including individual gold in the 100 freestyle at the 2012 London Games. Joining him, an all-time Paralympic great who's in her 20th year of international competition, and she's still going. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome eight-time medalist Nathan Adrian and 29-time Paralympic medalist Jessica Long. Jessica, it's always nice to see you. And here we are presenting the race of the year. It seems like a good time to ask. After all the gold medals and the world records, do you have a personal all-time favorite race? Hmm. I suppose that's like asking a parent to choose a favorite child. They all mean so much to me in different ways, depending on where I was in my life at the time. How about you? I mean, I don't know. I guess the obvious answer it would be the Hunter Free in London. <laughs> Which, by the way, you won this very award back at the 2012 Golden, Go Golden Goggle Awards. I did indeed. And yeah, that one was unforgettable, but sometimes I think I might pick one of the amazing relays that uh, I was lucky enough to be a, a part of. Well, one thing unites every priceless swim. that It's that profound feeling of personal satisfaction that you went out and turned your goals into reality. This summer, at the World Champs, these three gentlemen did just that. Here are your nominees for the male race of the year. Olympic gold medalist in trademark think comeback style. 20 years of age at his first World Championship. He's got that New Jersey edge, dude. One of the greatest backstrokers in history. In the 1500 in Japan, Bobby Fink crushed the American record by over five seconds. In a race for the ages, the Olympic champion battled a hard-fought silver. It's been a dogfight, and they're going to the wall at the last touch. Trying to go into this race relaxed and calm. It paid off big time for me, best time by five seconds. In the 100 free at Worlds, Jack Alexi delivered an outside smoke. From lane eight, he charged to a silver medal, becoming the second fastest American in history. Alexi gets the silver in an unbelievable rebound from last night. You know, very happy with second place. You're looking at the future. Team USA's veteran captain, Ryan Murphy, has achieved virtually everything in his career. In Fukuoka, he added to his decorated resume with his first ever world title in the 100 back. Murphy to take gold! against a world record holder, being able to get a lick in, come out on top, that's, that's really cool. And the Golden Goggle Award goes to... Bobby Fink! Going to the wall at the last touch! Uh, so uh, thank you for voting for me. That was an incredible race, especially by Hafnawi, who beat me by five one hundredths in a mile, which stings a lot. Um, but you know, it, it was an incredible race. Um, can't thank you guys enough. USA Swimming Foundation, uh, Team Shack over there. Uh, my sponsors, Tier Sport, they're in the house. They came, um, and yeah, just thank you guys so much for all the support and going into a, a good year this year. It's exciting. Thank you. Oh,